time I try to jump into some of the older Borderlands games because this looks really cool. Ugh, does every animal on this planet have to look like a giant monster? Well, I guess that's the beauty of the planet. I think there are some in front of him. No, no, that. I'm dead. And I really love uh, some of the um, uh, descriptions here, for example, strange fucking height. That I really like that. Um, no. I think it's the, the one from far. Breath of Fool. Stuffed and moved it because he was like this thing. What are, <laughs> what are you gonna do? Stop me. Yeah, I, this is freaking hilarious. We done. Which I expected from uh, Toto. Oh, not to be confused with his brother Boom, was the first mate of Captain Flint. As his name subtly implies, Boom enjoyed hurling caustic explosives and making things blow up by any means necessary. Who around here doesn't? Pandoran resident and fine dining connoisseur, Shade, was held in high esteem by his fellow neighbors in Oasis. Not in the least bit insane, he will be missed. I am really not into this at all. Nope. Oh, I remember this guy. He's an asshole. Formerly a scientific researcher who worked for Hyperion, Professor Nakayama was obsessed with cloning Handsome Jack, who he carried a certain fondness for. Killed by stairs. Stairs. No joined her? You must be more traumatized than I am. Hey, he's still got his Hyperion ID check. Really? Keep it. Hyperion pays out a nice bonus for recovering those things. Oops. That is a very interesting story, guys. The once ruthless leader of the Crimson Lance, Commandant Steel. Her leaderness came to an end when she was skewered by a monstrous tentacle. She later died a second time after having been resurrected as some kind of cyborg zombie thing. Can we just get on with this? We can. Of course we can. Oh. It's locked. Oh, come on. Are you serious? Well, this feels like we came in the back, so maybe there's a front door somewhere? Yeah, I don't know if we can get out there with the murderers all over the place. Maybe one of those bodies has a key or something and we just missed it. Wow, I mean, if we just randomly found the key, I mean, that would be amazing. Of course, he's not insane. How are you? Not great. Are you two not just the handsomest devils I've seen in ages? <laughs> I love him so much. Why are you pretending to be dead? What? <laughs> dead? No, 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 no. Asleep, maybe. Dead. That's your. You're getting ahead of yourself. <laughs> what? 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 What is this? Is this part of the like some kind of ride or something? Since the moment we walked in, it's just been one big freaky puppet show. So Thanks. I. Thanks. I'm Shade, and this is my world of curiosities. Let me tell you right off the very bat. I am deeply sorry that you strapping young threshers of gentlemen here have to witness it in such sad disrepair. Time can take a toll, you know, and on more things than one. <laughs> <clears throat> but unfortunately, we are closed for renovations. But that doesn't mean you have to leave, of course. No. 
<laughs> I mean, we can do other things. We're looking for a man in August. We're supposed to meet him here. You know anything about that? Oh, sure, sure. Why didn't you say so, huh? <laughs> You're late, actually. Yeah, we know. Yeah, if you want to buy something strange and illegal, <laughs> this is certainly the place to do it. <laughs> yeah. Word of Curiosity got you covered, all your illegal traders, all you little buggers. My grandpappy, he's the one who came up with this place. He was a real thinker, you know, a real lover of animals. <laughs> Still is actually, because he's definitely not dead. But the place itself. What happened? You get stuck in traffic? You Hyperion guys, you're usually so punctual. Getting 10 million together can't be too much trouble for you guys. I assume you'd have that kind of scratch as walk around money. Yeah, <laughs> well, sorry we're late. Getting here was a little more complicated than we thought it'd be. Yeah, well, that's Pandora for you. If it ain't a friggin' bug stampede, some jerk off is using you for rocket practice. All right, well, <laughs> I'll just leave you to your business things then. I'm August, but I figure you know that already. Vasquez coming? Vasquez? <laughs> he was just the go-between, the middleman. The puppet, the pigeon. Stop. I'm the one who's buying the key. Yeah? Well, I guess as long as you got the money, one Hyperion bootlicker's as good as another. So, what's your name? Just so we're on uh, equal footing. It's Reese. Reese? Reese. Isn't that what I said? Sure. Just sit down and let's do this so we can move on with our lives. No, oh, happily. You're the one making problems. Was I able to spell okay. my name right so, and stuff? Let's see the money. Cash only for this deal. And I hope you brought big bills. Show him the money, Vaughn. No problem. Okay. Uh, sorry. Uh, it's all the passwords on this thing. What's the problem? It's not a problem. It's a security thing. Just give him a second. Maybe this will give you some incentive to hurry it up. Did you ever see anything so pretty in your miserable lives? This thing will practically dance at your wedding. State-of-the-art alien crap. I'd use it myself, but, you know, the monsters and all. It's goddamn gorgeous. Freaking A right it is. Okay, so, the way I, uh, usually do these things is... Wait! What? I... Oh, I just don't like it. I got a... I got a feeling. What feeling? Look, you said when I started to get a feeling about something that I should tell you and that we should walk away, right? What are you possibly feeling right now? We're almost done. I get intuitions about this stuff. We're good here. Everyone relax. We just want to buy the key from August and go. Yeah, he just wants to buy a key. From me. Sasha, what the hell are you... I just... I just don't like it. They've had this dumb attitude on their dumb faces since the moment they walked in. What are you talking about? They've been all... Oh, yes, sir, and oh, no, sir, and oh, I have the money we agreed upon right here. Nothing you're saying is bad. Nobody does that! And especially Hyperion ore monkeys who'd rather bomb a small village than talk things through. I mean, look at that guy. Look at his face. What's wrong with his face? You can't trust a face like that. Hey, Sasha, Sasha, listen to me. I, I'm asking you to please trust me on this one. I know you don't trust Hyperion. Yeah, you think? And I know you have zero reason to trust us, but I'm telling you, we are not like those assholes. In, in fact, we're trying to get back at one of the worst assholes up there, and we need that key to do it. So please, take the money and let us screw over one of the biggest jerks on Hyperion. Please. So you're saying this key will get used to screw over some wretched Hyperion stooge? That's exactly what we're saying. 
I'm sold. Awesome. Let's do this. Well, just wait. Just wait. No, 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 August. Everything's fine now. I mean, I don't know. If you really think. No, no, it's okay. The she fucked up more than she thought she will. I don't know. Maybe today's not right for this. If, if, if things are weird, if you ha have a feeling about things. August, come on. I need that key. Promises were made, and. And, and, and my bosses are expecting... No, I'm, I'm sorry, guys. I was... I thought I was going to deal with Vasquez, and now this, I just... I just think we should call it off until I... I think things are square. Maybe another time, fellas. Hun, we're here. We should just do this. Really? No. I made up my mind. August, wait! Reese, this is your department. Do something! And here, I think it's a really important situation too, because soon we'll get two choices. So we can break his heart, which is negative, or blow his mind, which is partly manipulation, but mostly it's positive, it's not making him feel really bad, so gonna blow his mind and hopefully this will be good in the future. August. Actually, that's okay. You don't know it yet. Know what? Uh, this... This is it. You can't see that one day. Maybe ten years from now. Maybe ten months. Maybe tomorrow. You're gonna think back on right now and scream to the stars for mercy of death just so you'll not have to live in the wondering of what could have been. What if I had seized that chance by the throat? What if I had beaten my fears, taken what was so rightfully mine? What if I had won? <laughs> I am a winner, Reese. Like, right now he feels bad, but we're making him feel better basically 